guys, so I was tagged quite some time ago by a golden tone from Safety Sky to do this tag, but I never really like go around doing it because my computer was down and the converter was like spoiled or something. I can't seem to convert my videos properly, so finally I'm getting down to do it. So this tag is the 20 questions about you. So what's the questions actually? So let me get started. So the first question is things you cannot leave the house without. Um, I can leave the house without my wallet because it contains like all the things like money, my student card, my Ezlink card. Um, my phone, my mobile phone, but most importantly, I cannot leave the house without is keys. Okay, because um, my mom works and my brother goes to school and my dad is like probably not at home most of the time, so like the house most of the time is actually empty. So if I don't leave the house without my keys, I will get locked out. So yeah, this is the most important thing because if I'm going like nearby, I can go without my phone and my wallet, but I just can't slip out of my key. So this is the most important Second question is, favorite brand of makeup? I think most of you probably know that I love MAC. But I'm starting to like Everyday Mirrors, Awesome, and I also like Stila. But well, the most funny thing is the first brand of makeup which I started out with was actually Clinic, which my mom introduced me to it. But I I didn't continue using Clinic because um, the range of colors are very little and I think their foundation shades don't really match my skin, so I I didn't go in that direction, sort of. And the third question is favorite flower. Uh, favorite flower is tulips. I know it's the most expensive flower in the world, tulips, but I just love tulips, especially the purple ones. Because when I was um when I was young, um someone gave me a stock of a tulip. Yeah, I think I, I can't remember who gave it to me but from time on I kinda of really liked that flower and when I heard that it was um the most expensive flower I, I think I liked it even more. So yeah, my favorite flower has to be tulip and they are the um, sort of um how do I say? They have the long they have a a long I stand so they don't die easily, so that's probably one of the reasons I like them as well. A good question is heels or flat? Um I'd say both. I mean I do wear heels and I do wear flats depending on the occasion. Um because I'm kind of short so I I prefer to wear heels, but that doesn't mean that I don't wear flats. Because if I, when I go to school, I normally wear flats, but sometimes I do wear heels as well. And I think heels, they probably make me look up better, I guess. They make me look taller than you yeah, I'm short. So, um, I think both. Yeah, but I don't really feel like I'm painful for wearing heels. Actually, because most of the time I wear wedges, so they are kind of, um, the weight is kind of distributed well, so it's okay. So I wear both heels and flats. The next question is, do you make good grades? <laughs> this question. Well, when I was in secondary and polytechnic, I get really good grades, you know. I mean, my O-levels, I got, um, an aggregate of 11 for 6 subjects and I left um, Polytechnic with um, a GPA of um, 3.67 I think 
yeah, three point six seven, so that kind of qualifies me for the local university. But when I went to university, um, I think my grades sort of slipped. <laughs> yeah, I guess like many people in university are like clever or as clever as me, and I would say my grades in university are averaging about B. Yeah, I'm averaging at B. Mm -hmm. Not that good, but hopefully I do well enough for me to qualify to do a master's next time. And the next question is... Favorite colors? I don't really have a favorite color. I mean, my colors are influenced by people. Because, um... There's one time my friend liked green, and I started liking green. My mom liked red, so I started liking red. And then when people like pink, I also like pink. But for me, if I would say my favorite color, my favorite color would be yellow. I think because more or less, I always find myself like wearing yellow. But it depends, you know, because my colors are easily influenced by people. I don't really have a favorite color. And do you drink energy drinks? Um, I guess so. If you consider Milo and Hundred Plus. I mean, I drink Milo in the morning, and I drink 100 plus wherever I want to drink it, <laughs> because it's a soft drink. So, I, I I think they qualify to be energy drinks, so, yeah, I drink 100 plus at Milo. <laughs> and, do you like, do you drink juice? Um, I don't drink it if it's offered to me, it's not that I would uh, deliberately go and drink it. If my parents or my friends give me juice, I'll drink it. I guess. I mean, I don't have anything against it, so why not? Um, do you like swimming? I used to like swimming, but as I grew older, I didn't quite like it because uh, as I grew older, I I kind of hate the sun. As in, I don't really go out in the sun much because I prefer to be fair. Unless I go for a night swimming, but most of the time, swimming pools are in Singapore are closed like quite early, so I don't really go swimming that much nowadays. Yeah, you get it. You get the idea. Uh, do you have friends with a fault? Actually, I do. I know some people might find a bit. Um, I find it hard because most people actually eat fries with their fingers, but. I think it's more hygienic to actually eat your food with cutlery because unless you wash your and even if you wash your hands like it's not totally clean. So if there's a fork I will use a fork to eat the fries, but most of the time like McDonald's they don't offer fork, I will just eat with my fingers. But most of the time I do eat fries with my fork if it's if there's cutlery available. And then Favorite moisturizer. Okay, uh, I don't use moisturizer. Yes, because my face is oily, and my doctor told me not to use uh, moisturizer because he said that um, Singapore's weather is humid enough, and there's enough like water vapor moisture in the air to actually moisturize my face. So, I listen to him and I don't use moisturizer. And it actually works quite well for me, so, um, no favorite moisturizer. And do you want to get married later on in life? Um, yeah, why not? I mean, everybody needs to get married in life, okay? I may be quite ambitious, but I used to think that, um, Somewhere out there, there is someone waiting for me. So, yes, I do want to get married live, but currently I'm single, so I think the main aim now is to actually find somebody first before I discuss this issue. So, yes, I want to get married, but I need to uh, have a relationship first. <laughs>